they had a, they had a pretty good example. It was something along the lines like moving it, moving my dog or something like that. But I guess that sort of works. Okay. Okay, so now I have this huge area. First, let's make this more of a gradual. There we go, that's a little better. I have this huge area now. This will be my house sort of thing. And then off of this, I want like a moat around the sides or something. Does that work? Is that going to be too tough? I'll try to do it. Okay, so. Okay, I should probably do it on this side, I think. At least in the beginning. Okay, so maybe I'll have to work with it down here and then build it up so I have some sort of foundation. What are you doing, spider? Oh, jeez. Jeez. Okay, I'm actually gonna come over here, make sure you're out of the way, and kill you. So I need your string. But I should probably light that. Oh, oh I'm out of inventory space. Okay, let me place all this stuff down. I don't really know the layout of my house yet, so I'm just gonna place it randomly. What did I? Oh, there we go. Okay, that was very random. That was a little more random. Okay, that was weird. It's a really weird placement. Um, let's see, I want my dirt. I can throw all this other stuff away now. Okay. And then, bam. All right. Pick this up. Come down here. Oh, jeez. I think I need to go lower, don't I? This should be pretty good, right? Then I have that one there going all the way across. This one going across, and then I need this one. And then like I'm gonna get out of here. That and I just continue that all the way around, I think, and then I fill it up with water. So we'll see if that will work. Right? Okay, so that means I can't fall off over this way if I fall into here, but I'm all protected and stuff. So let's just do one strip. Let's see how far I need to go. Oh jeez, that was close. Okay. Okay, we'll just continue this down. Okay, and then these two be a little easier. So we're gonna shift here, I guess, because don't want to risk it. All right, and this guy. I don't think I've done anything like this before, so that's kind of neat. Okay, let's see. How do I build these two? Bam.
Okay, then I'll do the same thing over here. Looking good. Oh, did that creeper just spawn there? What the heck? Let me go. Boom. Okay, and this guy. Oh, this water's gonna be so. Hopefully, it's not that bad, but I have a feeling it's gonna be quite annoying. I guess it's two, two by two there. Just two across, not really two by two, but shouldn't be that bad. But I don't know. okay, so we'll just follow this all the way through. I guess. <laughs> Sexy vanilla flushness. Ho 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 ho. And coming up my head here. Sexy vanilla flushness. Boom boom boom. Oh look at this in the mirror. Okay, that's not what I was talking about, but I'm gonna clutch it out before it's completely dark. I just realized something. Well, maybe not so not oh, but the water's gonna seep through the moat thing, isn't it? Which it might turn out to be kind of cool, but that's gonna be interesting. Because it's only one block thick. All right. So let's place these around. Not equal, but that's cool. Okay. So now I'm like, oh, look at this, this is so nice. Boom. I'm good. I know I'm going to be like, oh, boom, this is so nice. Maybe, I, oh, it'll be sweet. Okay, so I just came up with this idea too. I have the like water going out from here, you know, and then it flows into this pool of water, but this is all just kind of standing water. And then like underneath here, I have it another moat and like moats all the way down. It's like a massive fountain. Like my house is a fountain. Oh my gosh. That seems kind of awesome. Like it'd be a lot of work. And it's kind of pointless, but I've never seen or thought of anything like it, so I think I might do it. But maybe I have it like holes like through there or something. I don't know. I'm going to have to experiment with it. Okay, let's... Now I want to keep playing. Oh, monsters. Oh, jeez. Jeez. No! 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 <laughs> oh, I didn't understand. Why was there an Enderman there? Oh, uh, I should have just. Okay, lesson learned from this hardcore. Let's play. Um, don't. Right when it's nighttime, go to sleep. <sighs> Dang it! Dang it, dang it, dang it. That that sucks. I'm not going to delete the world. I just can't do that. Um, I have still haven't deleted the other hardcore Let's Play world, but I just, you just don't spawn into it. So I just exit out of it. But, oh. What? Okay. 
So I heard him, and then I'm like, oh, I have to attack him. Right? Did I have to attack him? Maybe that was my mistake. Because I thought, oh, there are monsters nearby. I kind of have to deal with that. And then he, like, two hit, two hit me. Jeez. How did he get there? How did he... He couldn't, like, spawn there, could he? Oh, man. If you guys want to go watch the tape and tell me what happened, tell me what I did wrong. Um, but that fountain idea is pretty sweet, so I think on my next hardcore let's play I'm gonna try to execute that because that seems pretty freaking awesome I was actually like at first going on I'm like okay you know short episode but now then by the end of it I was like okay let's I'm keep want to keep playing even though you know I've recorded my episodes or whatever um but of course I die right there so that's stupid at least I didn't die falling off something because my I like either released my pinky like my pinky spasmed or the shift stopped working or whatever so, a little better. Um, but you got these cool, like, orbs going in your face. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode, series, uh, whole thing. I'll be back, though. I'm going to do this fountain idea. It's going to be freaking awesome. All right. And I'll see you guys later.